This is beautiful. This is incredible. This room is called the Kishla. And in the 1940s, it was a prison. But after Israel gained its independence in 1947, they were able to come in here and do some excavation works. And they found civilizations going all the way back to the first century. You can actually still see the remnants of the prison bars in the roof where they cut them out. This is really a great space. What we have at the very top are the layers from the 20th century when the prison was here. And as they began digging, they found ruins that dated back to the Crusaders in the 12th century, and then the Byzantines in the 4th and 5th century. And of course, what we're most interested in is what they found here on the very bottom, which dates back to the second temple period or the first century AD. This would be the foundation of King Herod's palace that sat here on the western side of Jerusalem. So that would be a Herodian section dating to the same time as that first century road over by the Temple Mount. Sure. So you just keep marching down through the centuries and you get to the time of Jesus. And something that was pointed out to us is that on either side of that wall are tunnels that run in opposite directions. And knowing Herod the Great and how paranoid he was, he had built these tunnels for escape purposes, primarily to move water, but also to get away in case he needed to. So just above that, was where the trial of Jesus took place. 